Hello beautiful tribe. I'm trying again because I did just try to get on Facebook live and a lady just interrupted me. I'm parked in a beach car park. So there's some resistance going on but I wanted to muse on the concept of how life speaks to us and we all get this get this I'm sure on various levels and, and wonder what the meaning is behind things and when we're sort of sitting with an issue often we'll get reminders of it or we'll get things come up for us that, that kind of call us into exploring that further and so as you will have heard on this week's podcast if you've listened we're talking about navigating relationship and, and intimacy with parenting and how you balance those two things together and really cultivate connection within the family unit particularly in those intense early years of parenting and I shared a story about how I'm sitting with my husband's expression of anger and where he does that and how he does that and what that represents for me and how I'm feeling with that um, because anger is something that I haven't always really been comfortable owning and expressing particularly as a mother um, and that's really part of a story that I'm unpacking and so today this morning I, I was driving and stationary and a car just banged right into me in my left rear kind of quarter and even with that like so there's there's messages in the in in the, the place at which we're hit by a car and why we're hit by a car what we're thinking about the moment before we're hit by a car and I've been really sitting with um, this this concept of not being able to balance everything and my hips have been playing up which is also about balance and I'm being hit on the left hand side of my car which is my relationship with my feminine and the person who and I was so angry with the woman who hit me and I was like furious at her and then as soon as I got out of the car I kind of just chilled and she said oh thank you so much for not being angry at me and I just thought wow like I'm really having to face this this idea of of anger being okay and not being okay and when is it okay to express it and I, so I really wondered if if you've got examples in your life that you keep um hitting against certain dynamics that are playing out for you um, maybe it's with your kids, maybe it's with your partner um, that you keep running into, that there's like a familiar feeling that, that's going on for you because when those feelings keep showing up that's when they're there for us to explore and, and, and learn from and kind of dig around a bit and see, see what the wisdom is in there for us. And so that's really what I'm sitting with today is why the uh, getting hit by the left hand side and what's that mean for me and what am I what am I talking to myself about? You know, what am I really needing to grow through right now? Um, I'm also coming off two nights of really poor sleep and, and really resisting my daughter's, um, you know, resistance to sleep, you know, finding it hard to, to really hold the space for her and, and not go into, to, you know, damn it, why won't you sleep? You know, I've had enough, I just want to sleep too. You know, it's been 14 months nearly of, of broken sleep. Um, and it's, it's, as hard as this kind of journey can be that there's also there's also gold in it and so I really invite you today with wherever you're at in your life and with whatever's going on in your family dynamic and with your mothering um, that you are just bringing some inquiry and some gentleness to yourself um, and to look for the wisdom in it and life does love us it just doesn't always feel like it um, if you want to explore a bit more of your family dynamic and a bit more of what's going on with your parenting and your kids and and what they're trying to reveal to you we'd love you to jump into our aligned parenting course which is a two-week two course to equip you with some tools and toolkits that we employ ourselves just to try to understand what's going on with our kids and what they're trying to teach us about ourselves so that we can shift us and in turn help them shift too so that's me enjoy your day